Here we are in Washington. Who do we have here? John. John, look at him. He wore his head wreath that he made the other day. What is your last name? Perry. John Harry? Perry. Perry, as in Paul. Perry. As in Steve Perry, oh, Sherry. He also knew what Grey Gardens was. So this is, this is a sophisticated gent here. He knew all kinds of stuff that I didn't think a young kid would know about. So tell me, uh, he jumped in because he loves flowers. I'll fill him in. He loves flowers. He showed up a day late. And, and uh, he now loves wearing head wreaths to class. And he's struggling with his design because he didn't take the whole course. I, I'm struggling. <laughs> he's struggling a little bit. See, it's, a, it's an art form. It's These like are roses, are pink roses. I know that. You know, that is correct. It's, a, it's like playing the violin. You've got to take your lessons. So he only, he only showed, got here for about half of the week. Oh, and you missed all the bridal work the yeah. first half. So he's just, he's just trying a lot. I said, play and see what happens. We'll see what happens. Flor it's called Florist Gone Wild, this section of the video. I actually like this better though, it's coming out a little better. Yeah, like and it. what's your plans? Enjoy life and enjoy flowers and make people happy. Make people happy. Washington DC School of Flower Design. Keep blooming, Flower School 101. Keep going John, rip those heads off if you have to. What else do you have? Oh, you got Gabiosa. Right over here, this is what's gonna make it. Work some, sca like everybody else did today. It's one of my favorite flowers. Yeah, because everything dingy, don't they? makes everything look textured and cool. Try it. That's what the that's what the success was behind the other two neighbors who were working th uh, this one and yeah. that one, the scabiosa.